Hello my dear brothers and sisters in the Lord. I really apologize for the noise in the background. I have to do this today otherwise I will never get to do this. So I want to share with you a dream I had uh, in 2023, possibly around October time. I don't know the exact date. I don't have the date written down but I do remember the dream and I feel like this is the right time to share the dream and the dream starts off with the night time it was moonlight like you know the full moon you're inside the house but you can still see clearly what's going on outside so I'm looking out of a window a glass window and I see the roads the houses and the scene is set in India because I was born in India and I see two dogs running. They started to run uh, on like a ramp. The road was like a ramp and they started to run. And there was another white dog which started to almost uh, go behind them and catch up with them. So they were running very, very fast. So this white dog looked back at me in the moonlight and I could see his face and he was like, he had a cheeky kind of face which says, oh, I'm going to overtake them. So anyway, so they were running very, very fast and they were getting away from me. Now, the road that I'm seeing, then I see a tiger came on the road. And the tiger was more like jogging. It wasn't running, more like jogging. And... And I'm thinking, where are these animals coming from? The dogs I can understand in, in town, but how, how about a tiger? And so this tiger jogging, he passed on, passed on in the sense he went ahead of the road. And then I see like a white, whitish tiger. And he slowly, he kind of jumped very, very slowly from somewhere onto the road. And then he is just walking, very slow walk, you know, like if they've had their hunt and they don't have to hunt and they don't have to go anywhere and they're just walking in, in the jungle. That's how he was. He was just walking. And then I started to think, these are wild animals. Where are they coming from? So I'm still in the dream at this point. And then someone said to me i don't know who that was but it's like an understanding somebody saying oh they have built a bridge from the jungle to the town there's a new bridge that is built and these animals have hopped onto the bridge and during the night time because there's not so many vehicles and the road's not being used they're coming through the bridge and when somebody was saying this to me I had a clear understanding that these jungle animals were at a much lower level. Like in geography, they were at a much lower level. And the where the town I was in situated, it was on a high ground. So it could be several hundred feet above. So there's no way these wild animals could just hop on and come into town without a bridge. So they had built a new highway and this bridge kind of made it possible for these animals to hop on and come into town and they were walking. And my dream ended. Now, when I woke up, I was thinking, what was that about? What was that about? And it took me a couple of days before the interpretation just hit me. Because around this time, I was seeking the Lord about investing in any of the BNB Tiger. This is much after the BNB Tiger dream that I had, which I've already made a video. And there was BNB Lion and then White Tiger Moon. These are coins that I have invested in, small coins. And I invested after this dream because I, I wait for instructions from the Lord, no matter uh, which crypto is doing, wherever it is going, it doesn't matter. 
if the Lord has not written it in my name, then that's not for me. And I go, I always try to restrict myself, discipline myself to uh, follow a rule that God has to give me instructions. God has to tell me which ones to do what. And I'm not here to gamble. I'm just here following instructions. What, the, what does the Lord want me to do? So when after a couple of days, the understanding that I had about this dream is the bridge is the XRP bridge because XRP, as we all know, many people have made the videos about it. And I don't know the connection. Um, this is just a dream. This is not financial advice. So take it and make it whatever you will. Take it to the Lord and then make your decisions. It's just my dream that I'm sharing. So I believe these coins, even though some of them have got 15, 17, whatever zeros, and they're so cheap to buy, the Lord is giving us instructions. Just put maybe $20, $30 in and just leave it there and, you know, let it, let it happen in its own time and because of the bridge i started to see these wild animals started to come into town and they were walking and that kind of signified to me that these coins are going to increase in value and they're going to drop zeros but it will be they were in town which means people will be able to use it like normal also my understanding was the two dogs that were running in the front was like um, Sheba and Sheena and it was moonlight and the next dog which was a white dog that was running was Voltino and the tiger that first started was representing the B&B &B tiger and the last one which was the white tiger and it was moonlight and that kind of represents um, the white tiger moon and Lunk which is like the symbol of the moon itself it's shedding its light it's shining its light on all the others so I suppose it kind of makes sense that to understand that the dogs are gonna kind of chase each other and they're gonna run faster it's gonna go high up in value the tiger coins they probably are not going to make as much, but there will still be a movement. And that's what I understood. Anyway, we'll have to wait and see what happens this bull run. And it's just a dream. And I hope this will bless somebody. Take care now. God bless you. And I shall see you in the next video.